to the young people that registered and that's in line that was walking up to make sure they get served first. And having a nice school in the community, I think it's something that uh, when you grow up in the community in the inner city like myself, you understand, you know, how the schools in the, in the city are not as good at the, as, as the schools out, it's outside the city. And that's something that I wanted to be able to make sure that uh, myself and my foundation take uh, control over, especially in our education system to start um, with being in LA. Um, and hopefully years to come, hopefully there's an opportunity to be able to create somewhere else. But being my home base, LA was uh, strong and uh, something that I wanted to be able to uh, wrap my hands around, especially uh, being from LA and having, making sure I have resources for the kids in LA. How y'all doing? You doing all right? Uh, when given an opportunity to be able to help, especially our underserved Okay. communities, uh, especially education being the lead, leading role. And that's something that kind of where I started my foundation in education. Um, and it was an amazing opportunity to be able to, you know, get a middle school and a high school, uh, but not just that, be able to go in and kind of help create curriculums um, to help, you know, obviously post high school, uh, you know, job creation, um, find a ways to be able to better give us a, our youth and our underserved communities a better education, uh, proper books, uh, the good things that the good, other good schools have uh, to be able to help um, our underserved communities because that's who uh, get uh, hurt the most and uh, especially in our African-American communities.